This is part six in a series of videos documenting how we build a soundproof drum room. In this episode, we're gonna be looking at the plastering. So if you've liked the video so far, don't forget to hit the like button and to subscribe. So we got all the plasterboarding done yesterday. That's all nice and straight, uh, looking all nice and square. Uh, we're gonna plaster this today. Gonna to start with the ceiling and the wall behind me, and then later on do the remaining three walls. Uh, it's a bit of a grim day, so uh, and a Monday. So hopefully uh, we can move things on a little bit today. Okay, so with the plaster, I'm gonna start off putting some heavy duty scrim tape on all the joints. Uh, so that keeps it nice and tight and when it's plastered, it's not gonna crack. Uh, so we'll do that first and then we'll do a mix up and get our first coat on. That's key to dog. Some of this super sticky stuff isn't that sticky today. Uh, bits of it falling off the wall, so just put it back before we plaster. So that's all scrim tape done. Uh, this is like a sort of heavy duty scrim tape. Well, I've noticed that in places it was falling off a little bit, but it's sort of gone back on. Uh, yeah, so a couple of things you've got to watch out for. Um, sockets <laughs> and wiring. So they're the hard things to skim around. And also where I've got the window and door here, I'm gonna have to be careful because it's a bit of a draft. So just to get a bit of light in, I've opened those up, but generally those walls might go off a little bit quicker, so I better keep my eye on those when we get to them. I'm gonna start with the ceiling here and this back wall, so we'll get all those on in one go. Um, yeah, so we'll get a mix on, and hopefully get that ceiling and wall on, and then we'll have another little look. So we've got a couple of buckets of water uh, for cleaning off, and then that's our plastering bucket. A uh, little tip with this is I've put a bit of tape round, so that's roughly half, even though it doesn't look it, <laughs> that's roughly half the bucket, so that'll give you a full bucket of plaster, which is one bag. Uh, so we'll get that mixed up. We'll obviously start getting it on the ceiling and this back wall. The plaster mix that's a decent consistency. Uh, yeah. 
It's not too thick and not too thin. It's just about right up. So let's get that on the walls. And the ceiling. too much time on that, flatting that first coat, just trying to use the speed skin, which I've only used once or twice before. That's so. the first coat done anyway. So we'll just let that go off and then uh, get our next coat on. Okay, so that's mixed up. Um, time for the second coat. Uh, we're using multi-finish plaster, by the way, if you haven't spotted that already. Um, also, you've probably noticed that it's pretty ambient sounding in here. Um, obviously, just to say that it does change when it's plasterboarded, it changes when the plaster goes in, and once we put the acoustic panels inside and it's all been painted and stuff, it's gonna sound a lot different again. Um, yeah, so it's, uh, it's all taking shape. So I'll get this second coat off, on even, <laughs> and um, we'll see how we get on.
that's the second coat on. We'll just give that a few minutes before we flatten it off. on now um, the battery went on the phone so I didn't get the whole thing uh, but yeah I'm just gonna give that a quick trial off like a dry trial now uh, but yeah that's all in place and uh, ceiling and one wall on we're probably gonna do the other three walls tomorrow actually because um, it's been a bit of a hectic day it's raining outside and all sorts of other stuff going on so yeah we'll probably get to the other three walls tomorrow but yeah I'll just give this a quick uh, trial off just to finish it we got one wall on the ceiling done yesterday, so today we're going to do the remaining three walls. Uh, it was a little bit miserable, a bit damp yesterday, and uh, the joints were aching a bit. So uh, we're going to get a mix on um, and get these three walls on in one go, and then have a little break and do the second coat. Hey. I'm not a success. 
enjoyed the series so far in the next few videos we're going to be looking at how we make the soundproof doors how we make the acoustic panels and how we finish the whole studio we're even going to do a test at the end so you can see how good the soundproofing is so don't forget to hit the like button and to subscribe